Hello, I'm Max Mass, and here are our top stories. A woman in serious condition this morning following an overnight crash just west of downtown. San Antonio police on the scene telling us a woman was headed northbound on Frio Street. That's when she reached the Commerce intersection around midnight, and that's when she was hit by another driver. She was actually trapped inside her vehicle. She needed to be rescued by the jaws of life. Both drivers taken to the hospital. Police tell us that the second driver now being evaluated for a DWI. The two vehicles actually crashed right in the middle of the intersection, so police are trying to figure out who exactly had the red light and who will be charged. And arson investigators working to figure out what exactly caused a fire at a home on the city's south side. This is what we know as of right now. The fire started just before 11 last night. This is the 800 block of West Formosa Boulevard, right near McCollum High School. Firefighters tell us when they got there, they found the home in flames. That fire spread quickly throughout the house, causing the ceiling to collapse. Luckily, no injuries reported, but fire crews tell us that house is a complete loss. Now to the latest on the pandemic here at home and where we stand with cases. 287 new COVID-19 cases. Three more people have died. Our seven-day rolling average sitting at 298 new cases a day. Local health officials say this is a decrease since Thursday. The number of people in our hospital is also going down. 335 patients hospitalized, 126 in the ICU, 65 on ventilators. That's all for now. You can find latest headlines on Facebook and on Twitter.